Hi there, it's Sam from giantpumpkins.co.nz again. This time I'm going to be talking about one of the most important things you can do before planting your pumpkin, and that is testing your soil. One of the easiest ways of doing this is getting a pH soil testing kit. This one here cost me about $18 from Bunnings. It can do 30 tests and it should last you many years. Inside it you'll find um, a little instruction booklet on how to do everything and um, a colour chart at the back to match up everything. You have two bottles of the pH test solution, a little spoon, um, barium sulfate powder which is done in testing and a little empty where are we? A little empty test tube there. So it's quite a simple process. You fill up your test tube with some um, soil that you've dug up. All the instructions are in the booklet. Bear with me. You really want to fill that up to the one mil mark. You get your pH test solution and you actually before then you add one scoop of the barium sulfite powder to the mix. You then add up to about 2.5 mils of the liquid. Put the lid back on the little test tube and shake it. <clears throat> you let this stand for a little while. Um, the contents will separate and you should get a nice colour which you can check with your colour chart in the little booklet here and find out what your pH level is. After 10 minutes of waiting you'll see that the items in this test tube have separated and you get a nice colour. It's quite hard to see but what you do is you just match that up to the little chart in the back of your book And you find that um, it's resting at about around about the six mark, which is good for pumpkins. There's heaps of other options for pH test kits. Um, there's simpler ones. There's probes. Mm, there's even the old litmus paper. Just whatever you use, just follow the instructions and. Um, if you need to change the level of the pH, check out the website and all the information's there. Thanks for watching.